Hello, this is how we drive mass communication and I'm again with another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how can you install Windows 10 to your brand new MSI notebook. This is MSI Bravo Love version 17 inch with Redden X processor 16 GB of RAM with 1 TB of SSD. It's a gamer notebook, you can see beautiful notebook. So I'm gonna install Windows 10 in this. If you want to check review video and unboxing, check the video description for that. Okay, let's go to the process. Here we go, for this we need few things. Obviously you have to need your notebook. You need a USB flash drive. And this USB flash drive has Windows 10 inside. If you don't know how to make this USB flash drive for install Windows, check my video description. You'll find video how to install Windows from USB flash drive, how to make USB flash drive also. So this is brand new MSI Bravo. I have so many videos of Windows installation. If you have different version, you can check those video too. And one more important thing, connect your notebook with power source. So I bring here the charger. I put on safe place the charger. I'll connect with power source. We hit the power button at the middle. As you see logo of Bravo and we don't have nothing this is blind machine anti no operating system now inject your pen drive okay a flash drive how you call it you have so many usb ports here i have one here so i inject this usb flash drive to one of the usb port here we go it's fine now we go to the next option, I hit again the power button to close this down, hold for a few seconds and I have to hit power button and hit F1, sorry F11, you see I'm hitting F11, follow as me, you see now we are in bootloader option, so you see different different booting option, I have first one boot from internet second is the same third boot from window hard drive that has samsung hard drive that is ssd drive the last one kingston data traveler in that i have window so i will go down with arrow key here we go with this key to the last option you have to find your usb drive when you have window after finding this I have to hit enter so boot will be from window installation let's see you see it's loading that means installation is starting you see now in this table you have windows option the language language of keyboard reason leave as it is or if you want to change according to your language and region change that after that you have to hit this button next button here you see this one hit this one now it brings me to this option it's called install now i hit this one as you see the system is preparing for the installation option choose this option accept all the term and condition of window hit next button you have two options here the first one actualize or update window while installation the second option you can decide as you like i hit the next option the second option because i want to do few things inside these are very important you have to prepare disk partition for this so in this case you see I have three partition the first one is EFI partition the second one is hard drive full hard drive 943 gigabytes I have one terabyte and the last one is DVD or CD drive they leave you some application for example Dragon Center the other drive so you never delete the CD option here 
the partition EFI will not touch even this one and we'll touch that this one and we delete this partition here we go for deleting you have to come here eliminated or delete I hit this one I accept this is done so I have free unlocated space I hit this one again you can see here new button orange color you will see hit new hit apply it will ask you some permission to make a drive for install windows it could be 500 megabytes for windows 10 i hit accept now you see i have so many drive don't worry about it leave them as they are and find the biggest drive you see number fifth is the biggest drive 942 gigabytes so check the biggest drive option that is your principal drive and it should say here principal okay go for that one hit next button here then accept so you see installation has begun you have to finish one after another 200 person so i will be back when i see something new and i will show you guys you can go and grab some tea coffee if you want because normally it will take 5 to 10 20 minutes depends on the velocity of your computer as you see now the percentage is complete and the machine gonna restart while machine is restarting you have to do some trick you have to take out the flash drive as you see this moment when it's become dark take out the flash drive slowly so you will stop machine boot again from flash drive i take this off let's see it's become dark and it should open in windows installation let's see it's not finding so in this case what we have to do we have to hold the power button we press this one and go to Dell option to bias okay we are in bias we have to put our hard drive as principal drive here we go USB hard drive, I put window boot the Samsung as a principal drive. This is all fine, Windows drive as a principal drive, I hit F10, I hit yes, and we'll wait to see what happened. So you see my flash drive is here, Windows is loading by itself, so I have Windows inside my machine. So you have to do all the process one after another, it will take little bit time. I'm showing you step by step. now we come to this menu you have to decide your region and the language other stuff so i leave the zone as i am here i'm in spain in europe i hit next button this is next one moment spain also i go forward hit next if you want to connect with your internet connection they ask you to connect with your ethernet port connect with the ethernet port and install all the drivers if you don't do that you have to do again in my case i will not do now i will do later and if you want i have a video if you not find your wi-fi antenna you can check that video how you can install wi-fi antenna to your computer so in this I'm not gonna connect with ethernet port but you should connect. I hit this one. Connect now all the things. I continue without internet but in your case continue with internet. I have to put a name in this. 
I hit next button. I don't want to put any password. I hit next. I hit yes. Accept. I hit accept. Yes. 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 All put yes or no as you read them and what you feel put them I'm putting yes to all yes permission all kinds of permission it says hola that is hello it's almost done the same and window is here so this is awesome guys so you have new window to your computer you see something here i don't have no internet connected so you have to connect with your eternal port and install all the driver this has some driver already inside i go to this computer you see here so MSI has given you all the driver necessary here. I hit open. Doesn't matter. I go inside here. You see CD setup. Hit this one. Hit yes. And you see all the driver and utility you have here. So this is how you can install Windows 10 to MSI Bravo Notebook. Okay guys, if you like this video, please do subscribe to my channel. If you like this segment, please give me a thumbs up. As always, for more information, go to the Ask Communication, www.askcommunication.com. Have a lovely evening. Take care. Till then, bye-bye.